Transistor allows you to create people profiles for anybody involved in the creation of your podcast. And now we've made it even easier to add new people to your show. Let me show you how it works. I'm going to select this show here, head down to the people section, I'm going to add my first person. But now at the top, you'll see I can enter my Twitter username, click load from Twitter, and it automatically pulls in my information from Twitter, including my photo, my bio, my link to my Twitter profile, and my website. If I click OK, use this information, it automatically just fills out everything. No need to manually update anything. You can just clean it up however you'd like. Choose the role of the person, host, guest, editor, and then sign them to all of the episodes they've been a part of. You can also make them a default going forward. Click Create Person. And now they've been added. These folks will automatically show up on your website. So any episode that they've been a part of, they'll show up in the credits at the bottom of each episode page. This also applies to the shareable social media landing pages we give you. So now at the bottom of each page, you'll see whatever creators and guests you've assigned to that episode. One more new thing to show you, we also now support LinkedIn URLs. So you can grab your LinkedIn profile link and add it, click Save. And then if you check out your people profile, it will include a link to LinkedIn as well, which is pretty cool. These features are available on every podcast you host on Transistor. If you're not using Transistor, you can try us out for free for 14 days, import your existing podcast, try creating some people profiles, create a new podcast, create multiple podcasts. It's all here on Transistor. Head over to Transistor.fm to check it out.